So if you're an evil character and you can either go to the square to get something you want or go to the character and fight the good character, you go and fight the good character. Uh, we play that. And uh, one, of, one of Nolan's friends decided that he, he was the troll and he was an alcoholic. So whenever he could go to the tavern uh, to try and get drunk, he would. Um, and he didn't win the game, but had an incredibly good time playing with it. And I think that we as gamer parents, we have a little bit of a responsibility. Uh, like I wrote in, in these books, and I've talked about a little bit today. We have opportunity when we play games with, with people. We can add gamers to the world, or we can uh, solidify the stereotype that gamers are antisocial and exclusionary and, 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 and difficult to sort of get along with. And I think that it's really important when we play games to make sure that people we're playing with have fun and that we leave them wanting to come back and play more games. And for gamer parents, you know, it's great. You can form bonds with your kids and you can know your kids' friends and you can create an environment where uh, as they get into high school and their friends begin having more of an influence on them than you do, your, your, your influence will come through their friends because they've been gaming with you throughout their entire childhoods. So um, please keep playing games. Games are important. Games are important.